Greetings and welcome back to Hotel Empire Tycoon. Alright, I have amassed nearly 60 million. And I'm pretty sure that's going to get me that third star. As a matter of fact, we might get that star really quickly. You know, I was looking back at the video when I bought the last presidential suite. You know, the one that cost you 29 million. And that really gave us a big move in the old star progress. I'm wondering if simply buying another presidential suite is going to get us that third star. It just might happen. And even if it doesn't, I still have a lot of resources to level it up and perhaps do a little bit more work. I don't think it's going to take very long. I really don't. So while it's the middle of the night, is there a better time for renovations? No. I'm sure the noise won't wake anybody. All right, so let's do this because we might be moving on immediately. And well, let's face it, if you read the title, you probably know one way or another. So let's just do it. All right, presidential suite. This is going to cost 46 million in change, and I have nearly 60. So maxing it out is not really going to be a problem after the fact. But I'm really wondering if I click that button, do I get the third star? Or do we get really close to it? Let's find out. And there you go. There's the third star. That, of course, means that we leave here. And no, I'm not going to miss this place. Not in the least. All right, because we are moving on to Little Camelot. Enjoy the life of a real feudal lord in this witch-free hotel. Well, it's unfortunate. Witches can be very uh, entertaining. All right, let's go. Traveling to Little Camelot. Now, I have heard that this place is a little on the slow side. Of course, the previous one was as well. All right, so we're starting off with 150,000. I'm guessing that's not going to get us a lot. All right, let's look around here. All right, well, okay, this is obviously where we are over here. All right, what do we have? Double rooms, 34. Okay, suites, 12. Royal Tower Suite. Okay, I'm guessing that's like the presidential one. All right, so what else do we have? We have a bar, we have a swimming pool, a nightclub, a casino, archery, medieval tournament. That costs 50 million. Wow. And then we got a spa down here. All right, the restaurant's already open, but here's the thing. Um, there's probably no money coming from that yet because we don't have anybody in there. That's generally the way that works, isn't it? Okay, there's where the electricity is. Hold it a second. Let's find... Well, I suppose we could probably do it... Hold it a second. I guess... Uh... What? Okay, I'm... All right, I guess no matter where we are, people just fall asleep on the couches face first. Okay, uh, as long as she cleans when she's supposed to. Now, where is the darn restaurant? It's got to be here some... Oh, here we go, here we go. Because uh, we don't have anybody here, so let's uh, hire somebody. Okay, so we'll at least start making money from there, right? As a matter of fact, why don't... Okay, somebody has come in. Unfortunately, there's nobody here yet, is there? Let's see. Uh, let me upgrade this table just once so we can get some extra money going. All right, and I'm wondering... 100 gems. Yeah, I'm going to do this one because it'll make us a lot of money, right? 100 gems, it'll add 40 bucks to everybody who comes in, right? For the medieval roast. Okay, and by the way, are there any... Oh, there are actually missions for this one. Okay, because there was no missions for the previous one. All right, that's very pleasant to see. Very pleasant to see indeed. All right, so let's see. What do we got? Okay, we have... What is this? A dancing... I'm not even sure what's... Dan is it a policeman there? I don't even know what that's... I don't know what that is, but it's probably money. Uh, actually, really, it's not money. No, it's not. Uh, that does not look like our friend. I'm not really sure what I'm looking at. All right, let's look around here because we need to make money, right? All right, let's go over here. Can we actually buy anything? I could buy another double room. It's pretty inexpensive too, so that looks sounds like a good idea. We'll have more people walking around that way, right? All right, so we'll buy one. I'm going to buy two. All right, so we have four double rooms. Now, I'm guessing that the bar would be next. That's going to cost 200000 and yes, by far, that is the, uh, the next one coming up. Oh, and I got some extra money for that. A mission, an amazing thing. What other mission is coming up that replaces that? Upgrade three double room beds 
to level two, that'll get me 10,000. Install internet in five rooms. Well, I only have four rooms, so I can't do that right now. All right, so what we wanna do is make as much money as possible, right, early on. So well, how are we doing here anyway? All right, these are all in the same condition right now. They're 6%, right? And they're all making the same amount of money. Now I'm looking here. Now the front desk is losing money, of course. Uh, housekeeping is losing money. The restaurant, the restaurant's a problem, isn't it? Because we need that one to start making money for us. How many people do I have here? I only have two in the hotel at the moment. All right, so why don't we just focus on the rooms and then see what we can do. Where are the rooms? Okay, there's one there and there's three here. All right, let's see, what do we have in these rooms? All right, we have the double bed, we have the two bedside tables, a television set. Yes, in medieval times they had television sets, by the way. Um, then they have a couch, the desk. Desks are usually good money. Climate control, okay, a fireplace. You know, that's, that's definitely something for the medieval times. Uh, mini bars, yeah, Wi-Fi, they all had that. Paintings, that one is new. And that's, a, that's definitely a bargain right there. An extra $17 per room for just $2,100. Even if you buy the first one, that's good. And there's another one. That's, that's pretty darn good right there. $14,000, that's still for $64. That's good. Although, yeah, it's a chandelier. It's going to require power. That's true. All right, let's see. What else do we have? Uh, this one. Oh, that's okay. We can buy the first one. A safe, that's, that's good. Although it does need a little bit of power. And then a library. Okay, there's some definite ones in here that would be good for making money. Now that one, unfortunately, is for gems. We're not going to be doing that per room basis, right? All right, well, that's a very nice little increase right there. So yeah, we're going to do that. All right, so let's see. What do we have here? Uh, I'll get back to you. I've seen some other ones that were really good. That one, for instance, definitely. Right? Uh, let's see. Oh, 1650 for 13 Yeah, that's good. And that one is also a good one right there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cut it there for now. I'll probably come back. Okay, that's a good one right there. Uh, we'll do that. Okay, and moving on. That's, I mean, I don't want to spend that much right now. Because the thing is, whatever I do, I want to do it in all the rooms, right? So I'm just kind of investigating. All right, 2000 I get 20 for that one. What was the previous one? Right, so the thing is, this one here, just for 2000 I'll get 20 which is half of what the next one was, right? I mean, that's a good deal, too. All right, so we'll get that one up there. Okay, that's good. That is also good. I'm going to hold off on that one. Uh, let's see. Uh, this one, yeah, 21 for, for 17 Very good, very good. And this one, too, 35 Very nice. Although I'm running out of money quickly here. I don't want to spend 14. Not yet. Not yet. I just don't have the money to do that. Okay, for, you know, that's a good one right there. And that's not too bad. And we'll hold off for there. Okay, that's for 15. Uses a little bit of power, but not big a deal. Actually, that's 16. That's pretty good. All right, moving over. I can't afford that one right now. All right, let me see. What do I got going here? I got a two and ones across the board, and then I got twos except for the middle one, right? All right, so let's see what we can do about this. I did that one, and I got another one there. And then, like I said, I had twos, because I'm trying to make as much money as possible. Which reminds me, how is our friend, our dancing friend going on right here? Hold it a second. All right, let's just check on our dancing friend. Yeah, but that's not going to do the job. No, absolutely not. All right, so how are we doing? We're doing 29.28, but we do have full occupancy. How's the restaurant? Yeah, the restaurant, you know, I think I have to add somebody else to the restaurant. All right, it's currently losing 240, right? So let's see if I add somebody else. I keep losing. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, let's see. Because currently you can only do two customers? Yikes. All right, we're going to hire. All right, did that make it better? No, it didn't. It doubled the loss. You know what I'm going to have to do? All right, hold on a second. Um, you're, you're fired. Yeah, you're fired. I'm going to have to do that. What I'm going to have to do is remember to take out those employees when I leave the game because... Um, 
yeah, I'll be hemorrhaging money. I mean, if you look at it at the moment, I'm hemorrhaging money from there. I added a second person, but it just doubled it there, right? So even though, even though adding the gem thing, it's still a problem. Okay, I was wondering, what was they doing over there? It looked like they were both moonwalking there for a moment. All right, let's see. Let's go back to this. All right. I did it for the first two rooms. Let's move on. All right, we're going to do a upgrade on that one. Then we're going to add the couch. Then we're going down to the desk for a double. And then the climate control for a double. Am I having an energy problem? No. I got 95 energy free. So I'm not going to have to worry about that for a while, right? All right, and then that one. And then two of those. All right, moving on. All right, let's see. I get this one up to two. And then add this one. Because I want to keep them all in the same range for now, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. There were twos, and then I skipped the middle one because the middle one was a little bit too expensive. Oh, am I out of money? I am out of money. Oh, wow, I'm out of money. I don't have money to pay. Okay, thank goodness I just got that because I couldn't pay anybody. All right, I'm going to have to be a little bit more careful now here, ain't I? All right, let's see. I was working on this. That's just 2000 Yeah, but look, I only have 8330 left. So we'll do that. Okay, tell me you have more than 1000 That's better. Okay, unfortunately, he didn't give it to me. Yeah, that's very annoying. I guess he got a little bit upset with me for not wanting to watch his other videos. But uh, there wasn't really a lot I could do about that, was there? Because, I mean, the thing about it is that he wasn't offering me a good amount of money. All right, at the moment, though, I am having a bit of a money problem. All right, let's see. Is there something... Well, this was the last room. Let's see. What about things that would be really good bargains? All right, that's good, but that's going to take half my money away from me, isn't it? I can't afford that. I can't afford that. I mean, I could do that. But I probably, at this point, should see about upgrading them just to keep them in sync with each other. So let's do that. And I'm not paying huge salaries at the moment. All right. So I got 2,158 left. All right, we're doing 3,652, and we do have full occupancy going here. It's just the thing is, I am hemorrhaging money from these costs that I have. We're still making a profit, but I'm just hemorrhaging from these costs. When I leave, I'm definitely going to be firing the individual at the uh, restaurant. While I'm here, he's kind of making me money. I suppose it would be better if I saw some upgrades in here that I could do. That's 2000 I don't have 2000 I don't have that. I don't have anything here. If I, if I click on any of these, I just lose all of my money. So I really need... Okay, we got the dancing friend back. Are you going to give it to me? Apparently not. All right, so I do seem to be having some problems at the moment. And uh, it's kind of costly. All right, so okay, we got messes here. But we do have a cleaning person. So that cleaning person should be able to handle four rooms, especially when they're double rooms, which means they're kind of the smallest ones. Um, where is this one again? Okay, she's not there yet. Oh, that's fine. She should be showing up pretty soon. I can't even do any of this, you know, upgrading these. But it is, um, it is just four rooms. So hopefully during the course of her work time, she can actually clean those for us. Yeah, so at the moment, there really isn't a lot else I can do. Okay, so there's a big line for food here. How much money am I getting for the food? You know, I, I figured two more people are going to get uh, fed, and the other ones are just going to leave out of frustration and anger. Okay, could you eat faster? Okay, 160, and then he leaves. It wouldn't surprise me if the rest of them didn't uh, get anything to eat. We're approaching 9 a.m. Does it close at 9 a.m.? It wouldn't surprise me a bit. So what's going to happen? 9 a.m.? No, no, okay. I guess he's going on until uh, 10. But you can see they're getting mad. Yep, they're getting mad and they're going to leave. Okay, well, one person... Okay, so I think it was like two or three people there that kind of left. But, um, yeah, that's the reason you want more. But the thing is, it'll cost me too much money. All right, there she goes. She's taking care of the, the rooms. That's good. 
So there's just four of them. So if she's starting at 9.30, then there shouldn't be any problem. More money? All right, how about you? Are you going to give it to me this time? Okay, that time I got the money. That's good. Okay, I'm up to 7,400. So I'm thinking, why don't I get some more money flowing here? All right, that's two. Th that'll give me an extra two bucks. How about this? I can't do that. I don't have enough money for that. Okay, that's actually a better deal than this. This is this is two thousand. I get two bucks. This over here is fourteen. It'll get me three bucks. So yeah, that's a better deal. And this one will get me if I upgrade it again. It's twenty four fifty, and it'll give me four bucks. So yeah, that's a better deal than the tables. I can't do that one because I'll lose all my money. What about this one? Yeah, that one. I I can't. I gotta keep. I gotta keep money available. Uh, I'm going to need 2000 because what I'm going to do is that when I leave, one, I'm going to fire the person who's in the restaurant, and two, I'm going to do this. And I need 2500 for that. So this one, I'm going to leave, and it will make me more money. As long as I'm not losing money from this, it shouldn't be a problem. Yet yeah, well, all our rooms are full, unfortunately. That's just the way it is. All right, so what, what kind of costs are we looking at over here? All right, the double room, the next one is 25000 That's not a problem. All right, the first suite is 500000 I seem to remember in the previous place that it was over a million for the first suite. I'm wondering if I'm remembering wrong. Now, it was definitely the first presidential suite was, I think it was $12 million or something like that. So these prices, at least here, are a little bit more reasonable. It's just that... How good is the money creation going to be? Now this, the medieval tournament, 50 million, that's, that's a lot right there. So I'm just hoping that's going to be a big money maker. Um, the casino was a very good money maker in the, uh, the previous hotel. Not enough to really get the money flowing though, you know. And uh, the nightclub, those can be very good. The swimming pools generally aren't really very good. Archery should be interesting to see how that works out and of course the spa you know this is interesting because if you look at it the bar should be the next one you install the first one I should say right that one's 200,000 the next one here is 1.5 million but if you go down here the spa is only 550,000 why is it hiding down here this should be the next one you install because I mean look it's a lot less expensive than the pool so why is it all the way down here alphabetical I mean, it doesn't make any sense. You say R, S, okay. Well, then you got electrical room and you got parking. But look, I mean, he's over here. Why couldn't, uh, why couldn't it be in here somewhere? I don't understand why it's hiding all the way down there. So just don't miss that. Our daily balance at the moment is 38.20, but then we only have six of eight. So it'll go a little bit higher. All right, so you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on it in the meantime. How much money are you giving me? Are you going to give it to me? Well, since the game crashed and restarted, I'm guessing the answer to that question is no. And we only have four of eight now. And the daily balance fell off the table. I'm guessing that's because my little doubling thing here uh, went away. So I'm going to have to restart that again and queue them up. Even though I found that maybe it was just that other hotel. I'm going to have to do that anyway. Anything I can do to make money is a good thing. So what I'm going to do is, like I said I was going to do, I am immediately going to fire this person. Yes, because now, where is it? Where is the restaurant? See, I'm not losing any money. Not losing any money at all. And then, of course, I'm going to do the old social thing right here and start that up. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So we're in Little Camelot. Hopefully I can get this going next time. Hopefully we'll be doing a lot more things. Maybe even opening the bar. Anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.